In a world filled with mysteries and wonders, there are few places as awe-inspiring as the Grand Canyon. Its towering cliffs and majestic beauty have captivated explorers and scientists for centuries. But what if I told you that beneath the surface lies a hidden world, a secret city that terrifies the whole world? Brace yourself for a journey into the unknown. As we uncover the astonishing discoveries made at the Grand Canyon. The Grand Canyon, known as the basement of history, holds the key to unraveling the secrets of our past. Each layer of rock represents a specific era, a timeline etched into the Earth's surface. But what if there were hidden truths deliberately concealed from us? Truths that could challenge everything we thought we knew? The basement of history, the Grand Canyon is not just a breathtaking natural wonder. It is a place that hides thousands of years of untold history. Secrets that explorers pass every day without realizing their significance. What if these concealed secrets could shatter the history we've all been taught? Is it possible that our understanding of the past is about to be turned upside down? Recently, a curious visitor from Norway stumbled upon an astonishing find. Ancient fossilized footprints embedded in the canyon's sandstone. These footprints, dating back over 313 million years, are the oldest vertebrate imprints ever discovered. They provide a glimpse into a time when unimaginable creatures roamed the earth. These ancient footprints were photographed by a curious krill visiting from Norway, who sent them to his old friend and colleague, Stephen Rowland. The implications were mind-boggling. Roland proposed that these footprints belonged to a creature that lived over 313 million years ago, making them the oldest vertebrate footprint ever found on our planet. But the surprises didn't stop there. Upon closer examination, renowned scientist Stephen Rowland made an even more astounding revelation. Not only were there footprints, but also the tracks of two separate reptilian species. One, about a foot long, exhibited a unique lateral sequence walk. A gait unseen in the history of vertebrate creatures until now. These findings challenge our understanding of ancient life forms. As Roland dug deeper into the study of these footprints, he made another fascinating observation. He noticed two sets of tracks, suggesting that these reptilian creatures had walked across the same site at different times. The brilliance of the Angel Trail tracers demonstrated the use of lateral sequence gates extremely early. In the history of vertebrate creatures, a fact previously unknown to scientists. Now, prepare to be amazed by a tale of adventure and exploration. Deep within the Grand Canyon, an explorer by the name of G. E. Kincaid stumbled upon an underground castle. A massive network of tunnels and chambers, hidden from the world for centuries. The entrance, concealed 450 meters below the canyon's sheer wall, leads to an architectural marvel beyond imagination. Kincaid, while rafting on the Colorado River, made an accidental discovery of a vast underground city. The entrance to this mysterious cave was at the end of a 1600-meter-long tunnel, hidden from plain sight. The architecture uncovered indicated that the underground city's builders were highly accomplished engineers. The subterranean city's central access resembled a huge camera, with radii of a wheel extending from it. As the explorers ventured deeper into the underground city, they unearthed secrets that sent shivers down their spines. Mummified corpses, wrapped in black linen, were discovered within the confines of the citadel. These ancient remains, all shorter than 2.74 meters, held the key to understanding the beliefs and rituals of the city's enigmatic inhabitants. One of the most striking finds was a tens of meters long, cross-shaped plant, believed to be a significant symbol in their religious system. An idol, possibly representing the city's main deity, stood tall, more than 30 meters from the entrance. The walls of the main chamber were adorned with copper weaponry and Tablets covered in Egyptian symbols and ancient letters. Among the artifacts, a white camera caught the explorer's attention. It bore mysterious hieroglyphics, potentially holding the answers the Smithsonian Institute longed to unveil. 
These intricate carvings could shed light on the religious practices and beliefs of the ancient inhabitants, possibly linked to the southern Arizona people's culture. The tomb or crypt where the mummies were found proved to be one of the largest, with walls sloped back at an inclination of around 35 degrees. The levels of mummies within the tombs, each in its own hewn shell, indicated a hierarchical structure. The lower levels exhibited more primitive urns and cups, while the upper shelves displayed a richer design, hinting at an evolved civilization. Interestingly, all the mummies discovered thus far were male, with no evidence of infants or females buried within. This suggests that the external area might have served as a warrior's barracks, raising questions about the civilization's social structure and history. Archaeologists have pondered the origin and identity of these ancient people, but their answers remain elusive. Intriguingly, the Hopi Indians have a long-standing tradition that their ancestors once dwelled in an underworld within the Grand Canyon. Legend has it that their chief, Macheto, guided them to escape this subterranean realm by growing a tree and piercing the underworld's roof. The people of one heart emerged, cultivating crops along the Red River, known today as the Colorado River. The Hopi chief sent a message to the Temple of the Sun, seeking peace, goodwill, and prosperity for his people. However, the messenger never returned, leaving behind a lingering mystery. To this day, during sundown in Hopi villages, the elders of the tribe continue to grow grain and corn along the banks of the sacred Red River, preserving their ancient connection to the underworld. The origins of these ancient people remain a subject of speculation, with theories ranging from an Asian origin to a connection with the Upper Nile region. Some even suggest a possible link between the Egyptians and this mysterious civilization beneath the Grand Canyon. While the report does not delve into specific details, the findings hold the potential to shed light on human evolution and ancient times. In a world filled with history and intrigue, the Grand Canyon continues to astound us. Its hidden wonders, from ancient footprints to a subterranean city, challenge our understanding of the past. As archaeologists and explorers venture further into the depths of this natural wonder, the hope is to unearth more clues and evidence, allowing us all to decide for ourselves what lies beneath the surface. So, the next time you gaze upon the grandeur of the Grand Canyon, remember that beneath its majestic cliffs and rugged beauty lies a world of mysteries waiting to be unraveled. Like, share, and subscribe to stay tuned for the latest updates on this captivating journey of discovery. Who knows what other astonishing revelations await us in the depths of the Grand Canyon? As we conclude our exploration of the incredible secrets hidden within the Grand Canyon, we are left in awe of the mysteries that continue to unfold. The ancient footprints, the underground city, and the enigmatic culture that once thrived in these depths challenge our preconceived notions of history and push the boundaries of our understanding. Join us on this extraordinary journey of exploration and discovery as we delve into the mysteries of the Grand Canyon. Like, share, and subscribe to our channel to stay informed. And be a part of the ongoing quest to unlock the secrets of this geological wonder. Remember, the Grand Canyon has more to reveal, and together, we can embark on a voyage of knowledge that will shape our understanding of the past and inspire future generations.